Rob told us life on set didn't always live up to the film's title. If you see the movie, there's this enormous dog in it called Mufasa. When the dog was working, I would, I would sleep in his cage. <laughs> it's just the ultimate exhaustion. The Twilight star has made a name for himself with darker roles and indie films since the Teen Vampire series wrapped, but he's still open to that franchise life. I'm open to everything. I mean, like, I have no particular plan of where I go. It's, I just try and read as much as I can and meet interesting people. I'm just constantly looking for anything that inspires me. If you're doing a franchise just by definition, like, it must mean a lot of people like it. Just gotta get him out of there before something bad happens. You get killed in there. You need another 10 grand. You get another 10 grand, your brother will get out. Good Times sees Rob as a petty criminal, raising money to help get his brother out of prison. And he was excited to hold the North American premiere in Montreal. I just kind of feel like a Canadian audience is much more accepting sometimes of slightly stranger fare. Something slightly less fun? Bleaching his hair blonde for the part. It was fun for a second, and then all my hair fell out. It fell out in clumps, and so... <laughs>